Oh, hey, look, it's our oh. athlete of the week, Charlie Hi. Powers. How's it going? Good. He's a freshman wrestler for Blair. Mm -hmm. How you doing, Charlie? Great. Awesome. Okay. Well, uh, we had three great nominees for Athlete of the Week this week. We had Charlie Powers from Blair, obviously. We had uh, Trenton Bauman at Fort Calhoun, had four three-pointers over the weekend. And then, last but not least, we had Kobe Wilkins, who uh, got to 100 victories as a, during his junior season this last weekend on the wrestling mat. That's How many? Good. Yeah, yes, it is, Charlie. How many wins are you up to on uh, um, high school wrestling? 30. Oh, 30. Not, not bad for a freshman. You know, you'll get there someday, I'm sure. <laughs> anyway, uh, Charlie was uh, undefeated over the weekend. Uh, we started off on last Thursday, went 2-0 oh in, in those two duels, the last two duels of the year, mm -hmm. and then uh, swept through your matches at the EMCs. And it is a very big week this week, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Why don't, why don't uh, you tell everybody out there in uh, video land why this is such a big weekend? Um, this weekend, we're going to uh, the... State duels. State and duel tournament, and guess what? Blair is the number one seed. Yeah. Woo! All right, so uh, Charlie, as a, as a freshman, kind of just tell me what you kind of expected of out of this year. Obviously, I'm sure you came in with some some sort of expectation and some pretty high expectations, yeah. considering on how well you've been done. I at least expected to go to state, and so I'm still hoping to do that. Okay, so yeah, we've got uh, three weeks to end the season now. This is state uh, trip number one, though, and it uh, you probably don't know. Because, well, I mean, you know, but uh, we didn't. We weren't there last year because you were in junior high still, right? Yeah. Junior high wrestling. So uh, uh, this year's different, where the dual tournament is before districts and the state tournament. So it's a whole different kind of thing, and I feel like uh, there's some high expectations for this tournament. Uh, tell me how bad the Bears want to win. Uh, the state dual tournament. Almost so bad to the point where you do anything. Okay. All right. So, did you hear that? They're going to hurt people this weekend. Is that what you're saying? Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> no, yeah. that is not what we're saying. Oh, yeah. That is not at all what we're saying, but a good competition. And uh, with the, being the number one seed, do you think there's going to be a bit of a target on your guys' bat? Yeah, most definitely. Okay. And uh, how, how do you kind of wrestle like that? Obviously, people are going to go through the lineup and see that you're a freshman. Mm -hmm. And, uh, want to go after you and pick up that win. So uh, kind of what do you have to do to uh, make sure that you keep up your end of the bargain and make sure the Bears are walking out of uh, Carney with a trophy over the weekend? Don't focus on home wrestling. Just go out there and do what I know how to do. Okay. All right. And uh, I always like to ask uh, questions of wrestlers like this. Uh, what, are, what are some of the things that you like most about wrestling? Like is there a certain technique or what, what does it bring out of you that – made it the sport that you've kind of gotten after and have really kind of excelled at? Um, I think I like, I like the team aspects, but, team aspect. okay. but I also like the fact that uh, it's one-on-one. -on -one. You, yeah. you, you can't just rely on the, your teammates to do everything for you. Okay. You can't hide behind your team. Yeah, absolutely. It's definitely, uh, it takes a lot of guts. To, I know I couldn't wrestle because I'm kind of a wuss. Uh, so uh, I, <laughs> so do, yeah, don't try nothing. I will scream and have somebody come help me, okay? Uh, but anyway, uh, the wrestling team uh, is going to have a lot of success in the next three weeks. I have no doubt that Charlie's going to have a lot of success. Today's videographer was? Bill Raskson.